We're going to get back into what y'all came in here for. Some great MSM action courtesy of two SoCal legends. Yep, this is going to be losers top eight. Uh, these two have definitely played a lot before. Politana and the Peach, both of these, both of these fine ladies are no shy to damage output. The two of the best of SoCal storage sub-regions of the IE in San Diego. Uh, Chase actually mold over picking up Peach in the past too, and obviously has a strong Peach player, uh, main practice partner in Tom Rod in San Diego, so. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know Chase has a Peach. He has just deep pocket in general. Yeah, just trying to work on the whole roster. I mean, dude completed that whole um, smash down thing on, on Elite Smash. Not Smash Down, but he, he perfected it with a win with every single character on Elite Smash. Yeah, I don't remember <laughs> that. He was like the first person to do that. That was crazy. Yeah. Nevertheless, Chase kind of getting a firm handle thing with the early goings here. Yeah, Chase yeah. looking really comfortable in that in this matchup so far. Oh, oh goes for the footstool. Foot okay, Roz is in fine form. Let's go. Footstool in there. Okay. Yeah. But Chase is still keeping a good job putting a lid on Raza's more explosive tendencies. At, the, at this percentage range, Razo is probably looking for more of like a detail. Tilt from him. He might be going for the snipes instead. Oh. Oh. And the Ford gets that F smash, beats that right out. Razo clean with it. He teed that one up, baby. <laughs> great for stock for him. Oh. oh, speaking of which, the downward aerial. Oh, you got to be careful. You do not want to be in any kind of uh, range of those uh, twinkle toes. Definitely. Perfect revenge stock here from Chase, keeping it even. Now we're going to be starting it off with just the Paul tax. He sees Nairs into the up airs, holding him in disadvantage. That and air dodge to the stage was so crisp. And Ross is like, anything you can do, I can do much more stylishly. <laughs> All right, just goes to the float cancel fair into the up smash. Oh, unfortunately gets tripped. Not going to get the tech chase, though. Yeah, mitigating what you do in trip situations is so key. Razo is just able to uh, gather himself and get out of dodge for a moment. That air dodge, though, was not long lasting enough. He's put himself in you know, no man's land here. Chase is trying to put the vice grip on the stock. Yeah. Ah, yes, he has to sell for putting him at the other ledge. Both these players are spacing so well. They really want to get the this advantage in this mid percent. Miles is playing pretty well around it. He's really choosing not to get hit. He's doing a couple of smash attacks. What is this, melee? You can punish Peach down smash in this game. <laughs> He's really throwing out those down smashes like it's melee. Wait a minute. <laughs> oh, excellent float in beat Tomahawk grab. Ross are so well known for that. The turnip toss down below. Are you you're just are you so used to being able to kind of get some recoveries for free with, with uh, Palu that like I'm pretty sure Chase is still like, like oh, okay, it's like that, huh? <laughs> <laughs> exactly, Razo is playing pretty well right now, but it feels like he's getting a bit too aggressive. Like I said, throwing out a couple smash attacks, overextending a bit, you know, he's pretty close to getting this stock, but now Chase has brought this back. Yeah, yeah Chase is doing a better job baiting him in, but oh, the slight immediate. All that DI toss. was. Yeah, that, that was wanting. <laughs> the TI was wanting. <laughs> oh, now Chase using the turret to get a lot of excellent coverage. Oh, uh, it doesn't hit on the below the ledge. I was always curious about that myself. Now we know. Oh, he has to go out deep. I mean, there, there's, a, oh, there's, yeah, a, there's yeah. a spacing for it to work because Peach will often have to go for the the, the parasol out like, out in no man's land too. But oh man, and they told me that doesn't kill anymore. <laughs> Sakurai lied to me. That was great. <laughs> that was such a low nair. Yeah. Now, last stock scenario for both these players. Chase has to play pretty careful too. Just one opening. We see, we know the capabilities of Razo get this damage in. Now Chase has a turnip of his own, trying to get something started, but not going to get it hit. This goes to show what Palatina could do without having to use one of her whole, like a good segment of her kit, the hole in the turnip. Oh, but finally going to get that opening. 50% already. Blink and you miss a damage. The flow cancel back ears are adding up. Razo definitely in the position right now to try to teach Chase another lesson of what it means to be a top player in SoCal. Yeah, this defensive play from Razo here is so good too. Peach is one of those characters that can kind of decide not to get hit. Goes for the reverse snare. Gonna get try to get the maximum damage. Still 50, almost 50%. And Chase now is trying to like figure out his pace and trying to like yank back control of this game from Razo. Excellent platform play. Oh, he almost caught him again. Ah, Razo with a panic air dodge, trying to take like avoid the immediate damage, but just got sent further out. All right. Yeah. But like Houdini, gets off ledge. Yeah, risky roll there. Haven't really seen it before. And lands with the aggressive fair. Chase is try trying to scout out the backer himself. Uh, I think Razo might have seen the light there for a second with the Zetos uh, turn up, but oh. So tough. I think that was a sweet spot of it, too. Beast fair is pretty diable, but at that angle, that was. I think that was death no matter what. Great stuff from Razo. It's funny because like he had tried so hard to like get past Chase's defenses and his movement with like spaced and delayed fares. 
And the one that does it, man, is just like the most like raw, the like floor, raw forward I'm just aerial. I'm swinging, maybe it is out there. I'm getting this hit. <laughs> now gonna be going into game two, Chase. Not yeah, this really is best of three territory still. Yeah, this is uh, loser gets seventh here. Whew. It'll be crazy here. Rosler again opening up with the. Moves himself, but Chase, no stranger either. These ladies are scrapping. Yeah, uh, now it's kind of jockeying for position, but Chase more than eager to just bat Raza away from the final third of stage. Big reversal now. Raza trying to step to his step to his loo. Yeah, these but twinkle toes are putting in work right now, and that <laughs> turnip is going to be the stock. Chase not happy about that. Just going to take uh, a breath here. Who would ever be, ha be happy about getting sniped by vegetables? Honestly, yeah, man. Me neither. I Me need my veggies with a dip. I'm saying, <laughs> I'm a V8 man. All right. Oh, oh. unfortunate. <laughs> not going to get this. Not going to get the edge guard here. Raza is so smooth. Sneaky in the last possible frame. They're going to get back to ledge, but getting bounced away with Nair. Yep. Raza's playing so well against this Palu space. He's just not getting hit or really getting opened up by anything. Now down deep, you have to be careful. Ah. Chase still not even getting any of these openings that he needs. This, this is so great. It's so difficult yeah, yeah. for Raza to get opened up. If they keep going back and forth like that, it does ultimately favor Peach just because a lot of her raw moves are stronger than Palu's. Yeah, like, they just do and do so much more damage. Outside smash stacks. Uh, but the thing is, Peach's figure more into her direct, like, immediate punish game, too. Yep, and that fair off the side, I'm going to take it only 60%. Not as bad as it could have been. Chase going to need to get a pretty good opening here, but this is so tough. Both these players are... He's more than willing to just hold on to it and wait and just sit on that lead. Raza's the one in my edge that to start to push the issue, press mm. the issue here. And ledge, down tilt! Down tilt oh. off, the, off the ledge hang. She cast that false goddess off of Mushroom Kingdom, baby. Oh my gosh, <laughs> this Raza is looking pristine. I going to get the nair again, but Chase is opening it back up. He's looking upset. And nice Rosso just to drift out deep, get past the ledge, and take center stage the Pokeball. Oh, just runs straight in, and Rosso <laughs> stopped it with the twinkle toes again. All right, Chase just kickstarted his easy. SDI to get out of that one. <laughs> 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 like, literally the ground. The pre-SDI. Oh, baby. I don't, know. I don't blame him. You don't want to be caught in the midst of the, the Rosso cycle. I am not cycle. trying to get hit by that. Oh, I'll oh. go straight into him. That one. That was know. the punish that Chase was seeking. That uh, was that one would have been hard to react to. That was there. a gift. <laughs> that was true. I missed the dash that too. Raz having a chance here to put it away. Right. Oh, that Chase? No. Oh, good yeah, get up great get up attack. And parry the back air. I'd actually like to see a couple more tomahawks here from Razo. I think one of the yeah. There we go. That's <laughs> you heard what you're talking about. Hey. All right, great. Gonna get the the peach bomber. Strong bear, but not strong quite strong enough. The float to the... Oh, I cannot yeah. believe that missed. But the uh, back airs itself finally going to get it. They sometimes knock down trapeze artists. You know, <laughs> so eventually, eventually. So. Razo finally getting felled there. Last off situation for both players. Uh, finally going to get the opening with the nair. That's what he needs. Oh, just barely missing it. Razo doing a good job just trying to limit how much mileage Chase can take some of these neutral wins, but nevertheless caught in the near blender again. The air dodge didn't oh, get the frame. Place to punish it, Toasty. Ah, uh, he he looked he looked like he had so many objects. Uh, I don't know what to do. Oh, he, got, he, he got crossed up. Ankle breaking disadvantage there from Raza from ledge. But now Chase is putting on the aggression. Hasn't been touched in a while. This is where Paulo really shines. Ah, get up that, get off me. Yeah. <laughs> That's, that slap is so funny. And yeah, that's enough space for a turnip pole too, but it's just not quite giving Raza the freedom he craves right now. He's saying, let me in, let me in from ledge. Yeah, Raza's playing this defense play, but now Chase has actually gotten around it because Raza hasn't been getting a lot of hits. A little spaghetti from both players, now the up smash. They try to catch uh, Chase just landing a little bit in, incongruously. Now we're <laughs> spacing out with these back airs. Uh, what one one has an invulnerable shield behind it though, Josie. So true. Advantage chase there. Oh, he just got past the explosive flame. And a great recovery from Razo. Neutral air dodging. This floatiness. This dude is getting tricky, but Chase has not been touched in so long. 113 percent. Immediate Peach Mama, get off me. Chase probably look for the tri state twist. Yeah, just that roll back to ledge right over the back throw. It works on elite smash, but it's not going to work on a smash vet like Razo necessarily. Razo just Chase trying to trying to kickstart his way to victory here. Chase can't. Be too hasty. Chase needs this game to force us to a game three. Raza looking to close this one out. He knows it's so close. Both these players are spacing so much. This is, this is cutthroat. And finally going to get the grab. First time we've seen him get a hit. But center stage, Woo! oh, great catch. Oh, from ledge. Oh, the Z toss there. Oh, my oh gosh. Excellent tech roll in by Razo. Yep. 
Oh, and the pop, mid-set pop-off there from Chase. Honestly, that was hard that. Fought. Yeah. That was the Razo show oh, for man. a good while. Finally, Chase just, winning that opening. Just when you thought each of them had the other dead to right when they got their neutral wins, the other one just immediately picked the yeah. immediate uh, defensive option that was right. Yeah, we and hadn't seen Chase throw out that dash tag because he got punished a while ago for it. He looked, it just looked like he was saving that for the end. Finally caught it. Raza was just trying to approach in, wasn't able to get any of those clean hits. Sometimes you pocket it, sometimes it's out of desperation, and it's just like a primal instinct move. Regardless, it is what gives Chase a chance at game three to try to dethrone Raza. Now game three going into Smashville. I like That's an interesting choice. Yeah, honestly, you don't really see this stage a lot anymore. We've seen it quite a bit on stream so far. <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> and I'm all for it, but already getting opened up. <sighs> Do not get it. Not let Peach hit you. This is how game two started off, too. Uh, Raza got off to a considerable lead, but man, as soon as Palatine gets those nares going, the up airs going, you start to rack up frequent flyer miles and Palatine and airlines. Yeah, <laughs> Palatine and airlines. <laughs> oh, you're funny. <laughs> That's my <laughs> one joke. Uh, There's so many Palo players in the region. <laughs> True. Hey, Raza's a fun character. Oh, oh, good. And but uh, can you get the neutral air dodge? Can you back? You can. Oh, man. I think if Raza was expecting him to get back, he might be able to just take him down there with the downward Z toss. Double but down <laughs> tilt into the back air, killing a great opening here from Chase. We've seen him really get so much damage, and then Chase just turns on the I don't want to get hit button. Yeah, right there. Yeah. <laughs> Gotta be careful. You cannot necessarily engage Peach with a lot of these mid range options if you're a little bit too careless with them, because Raza will like get his stock right yeah. back. He'll claim it. This is looking tough for Raza, just trying to close out this stock. Chase is not getting him a lot of opening. We've seen Rouse get a bit desperate with these up smashes. And it's and the air dodges too. If Chase starts to lock in on the air dodge habit that Rouse seems to have a bit above him, uh, that might be that might be mm -hmm. game over. <laughs> now we're seeing just the Palu blender. You're not going anywhere. Chase is looking so dominant right now. He, he's doing such a good job of stage controlling. Oh, oh, get off me! Oh, oh. I'm done with this. <laughs> Oh, oh down? pop up! It was so strong. No, you were not getting anything <laughs> off that. Rage down tilt set at that angle. Raza had to be careful how he gets back. Oh, oh let's go! The parasol into the nair. Pop and lock. True. <laughs> that was a great stock from Raza. Definitely needed that because this is looking dangerous. Woo. Now Raza looking for an opening himself. That flow cancel back here. We know what that opens up into. And that was actually Again. an excellent timed air dodge by Raza, allowed him to get, almost get uh, avoid being freed up by the explosive flame uh, bait. Turn up in hand, Razo is such a master of this character is out! Oh, oh. Tries to go for the Peach Bomber immediately. Razo knew what he needed. Gonna get the down throw. Just the light backwards aerial. Razo slowly bringing this back. Again, these flow cancel bears are doing so much work in with punishing Chase. And he's trying to yep. take this lead, guided by the right hand of Peach's crown wielding fair fist. But so far, it's Nair that's gonna free up that option here. Chase right covers land. He has to be careful about where he's gonna teleport to. Oh my gosh, that okay. just shows the how cool toes. the cool calm and collective Chase is under fire. Both these players actually going for these dash grabs. Jay's going to get the punish, though, with the dash attack. This has been working out really good for him. Let's try to close the distance between the two right now. Oh, it's the parry, but goes <laughs> for the fair. Now he's leapfrogging with aerials right now. He's trying to judge the distance. Instead, Chase to close it up. Nair forcing Rosso to ledge, but that was a miscalculation on the teleport, I think. No grab punish on the reverse grab. A uh, uh, bit of spaghetti for both players, and that backer finally going to get that stock off. Razo dropping a couple gifts. Yeah, Chase kind of caught his lucky stars here. Nevertheless, when you are the best in SoCal, you put your opponents in the dirt. Let's see if Chase can do it here. Yeah, as I said, Alleg, just wait for Raza to come to him. Yeah, Raza trying to grab these Palu aerials. They're notoriously difficult to grab. <laughs> hey, I wish I just grabbed three aerials, man. It made this game much more fun. <laughs> True. Raza needs to get this stock, but Chase is just content to hold shield. His back throw is not going to kill. Maybe the next one will. Oh, gets the Wait. peak. Gets the turn up. Ooh. Great angle. It charted the right does, course to ledge. And Chase does not want to die here. Oh, oh. Tries to get that sneaky flow cancel bear and the forward air. Great DI here from Chase. Not going to die yet. That's an excellent change up to the fastball of that back air. Razo served up, and there and we go. And another forward aerial. Razo is getting so many of these. There's such an aggressive option, but it's just working for him. And oh. gets the alley oop <laughs> off the turnip, but only 26%. All right, all right, got to stay humble. Merry go round, the turnips go. I can't believe that that, that was movement. That was wild. That was a pretty cool setup there. I bet you Razo is like hitting himself for not getting the turnip regrab. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We actually seen Razo miss a couple of regrabs here. Maybe a bit of nerves here. Well, Both these players want to move on. There's a lot at stake. Razo's throwing out a lot of rolls from these ledge. Oh, another air dodge! 
two air dodges in a row. And Chase is going to start keying in on that. Last off situation, though. Oh. Content to pull these turnips. That's such a good trade for Chase. Oh, he oh, had the, the setup. Bomber going to cash him out. Oh, going to cash the jump there, too. How deep he doesn't want to chance it twice, Toasty. He could have put himself again in that spot. Yeah, bad. Because yep. where else do you want to be for victory with Paul Tan beside, behind, besides behind that shield? Could not have said it better myself. Both these <gasps> and the turn no! up. <laughs> I think he needed one more rotation. That would have been it. That was a really huge opening for Razo. Is he going to be able to bring this back in the Tomahawks? He knows Chase is scared. Oh, he went too early with the, the turn up toss. Oh, and he, yo, he <laughs> went straight through that turn up. Yep, just going straight ah. to ledge. Gonna get that forward aerial. This is where Chase is gonna be able to bring this that's back. That's to do it. I don't. No! Okay. Wow, just, just the nerf. Sure and ah. that's gonna be it there. The Peach Bomber, unfortunately, not gonna snap to ledge. Chase gonna bring that one back. Razo almost had it with the glide cancels, but I think he needed one more rotation.